Hello and welcome to Dynamics Consultants. Many businesses make use of external accountants for managing their accounts, auditing and filing tax. For that reason, Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central comes with free licenses for use by external accountants. Although giving access to an accountant is essentially assigning a license, which would normally be done through the Tenant Admin Center, you can set it up easily through the Business Central application. Here we will talk you through the steps needed to give your accountant access. It is worth noting that you need to be an administrative user to perform this operation, and the SMTP functionality needs to be set up so that an invite email can be sent from the system. Firstly, click on the hamburger in the menu, which opens up what many people know as the Departments view, or My Business Central. Make sure you select Explore All to show all of the departments. Under the Administration heading, expand the User section and click on the Users link. This will open up the Users card, which has all of the users for your system. In the menu, click on Process and then choose Invite the External Accountant. This will bring up the Invite External Accountant wizard, which starts with terms regarding giving access to your data to a third party. If you are happy with the terms, click Accept and then click Next to proceed. From here, input the email address and name of your accountant. The welcome email automatically updates with his name, however, you can modify the email if you so wish. Clicking on Next will then set the accountant up and send them an email. The system will grey out, showing this notification. It can take a couple of minutes, so please be patient and it will eventually move to the success screen. Your accountant will now have access to specific data on the system, which can be managed by permissions. We hope you found this video useful. If you would like any more help, why not contact Dynamics Consultants for implementation, training and support services. Mm -hmm.